Hey, thanks for tuning into EasyLiving.com. Well, Andy's just landed from the United States and he's come on board Easy Living to be part of our team. And our first video is going to be about where to travel this summer. Let's discuss. Top five. Number one for me, I'm gonna go with, uh, well, let's talk about Europe first. I'm gonna pick the French Riviera in Europe, head to the Mediterranean, awesome cuisine, and you can do it on a budget. I suggest Cannes, which is beautiful, beautiful scenery, and uh, heck, you could hit up Monaco too if you wanted. Well, it's always a beautiful place, and uh, you can't go wrong with Cannes. Can. I'm gonna say London, uh, 2012 Olympics. It's gonna be a little pricey, but uh, the Olympics is always a great venue and a great reason to travel where the games are. You get to see the superior athletes from all around the world competing in sports that I'm sure you and I like. I'm a big tennis player. And Me too. So are Me you, too. yeah. I'm so. excited to see what happens. Um, definitely check out uh, London uh, with the 2012 Olympic Games and um, you'll have fun. No idea how everybody's gonna fit on that island, by the way. Yeah, space is going to be really tight and hotels are going to be booked well in advance. So well make sure advance. if you are planning a London vacation trip, uh, you make your bookings and reservations as of now. For sure. Yeah. Okay, let's go to uh, North America. I'm going to pick California. Visit the state of California. Go to Los Angeles. Of course, you have Hollywood there. You can even test your luck with trying to get on, uh, on one of the sets of Hollywood's newest films. Of course, if you play your cards right, that's no guarantee. Also visit uh, San Francisco, the Golden Gate Bridge. I believe uh, today is its 60th anniversary. Is it? Yeah, yeah. Um, so visit San Francisco. You can also head north and uh, see the wineries up in Northern California, which uh, is definitely the wine capital of the United States. So uh, also lastly, you could even try out surfing. I know they have a lot of parties on the beach at night. They, they set up bonfires. You can hang out with the surfers, chill out for a little bit. So California, North America, it's my choice. Cowabunga, dude. Um, absolutely, uh, if you are also planning a Europe trip, Greece is not a bad place to be, especially now with uh, hotels and facilities being more affordable given their economic situation. I think you can get amazing deals in Greece. Uh, someone was uh, leaving a message on my Facebook page uh, with sending us a picture of Greece. They're saying that's a great place to be. So um, thanks for the tip and the advice. Uh, so those are our recommendations. Uh, next, if you have any thoughts, any ideas that of places that people should visit during the summer of 2012, please let us know. Leave it in the comment sections below and um, let's talk tourism, and travel on easyliving.com. Thanks for tuning in. We'll See talk to you, you soon.